Okay, this uh, video will explain how to verify the frequency and the code between your radio and your transmitter inside the uh, control panel of your fitting room call button system. So, to um, first, we'll verify what uh, frequency and code are on the transmitter board itself. So. The easiest way to do this is you see the green connector coming out of the transmitter. You follow that down to the telephone jack that's below it. You're going to unplug that, which powers off your transmitter. You'll see that there's no lights on there. And uh, then you're going to plug, plug it back in. And uh, it'll start to show some numbers and letters here in this display. 1006, that's the software version. SS, this is your country code. SS is 00, is for US. FF is frequency 01. CC is your code 06. And the two periods flashing back and forth, that means you're booted up. Okay, and then also what you're going to notice here is that your receive light is flashing, and then you have an occasional. Uh, transmit light that flashes right above it. Receive lights amber. The, there's a transmit light in red. And then you have the heartbeat over here to the left. Green heartbeat. That means it's good. This is a good operation, right? All right. So now we have to verify what your code, your frequency and code are on your Motorola. So to verify your frequency and code on your radio, you turn it off and then turn it on, and it'll show your channel and the frequency 8, code 120, just like that. So now you know you're on frequency 8 and code 120. <clears throat> so back to your transmitter board, to change the frequency, you're gonna go to this little option switch here. It's got four tiny switches. The fourth one is use for the frequency. So right now we're at 08. I mean 01, I'm sorry, and we need to go to 08. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna use this play button on the top, this one right here, to increase your frequency, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. It's important to go ahead and do it like that, because if you press and hold it down, it'll probably overshoot. Now you're going to be trying to, trying to get it on there, and then you're going to flip that little dip switch back down. Okay, and then uh, to change, so it's going to flash your frequency, and then it's going to flash your code again, CC06. UU is for your volume, that's at 08. That happens every time you s switch your dip switch back down. So now we're going to change the code, which is the third dip switch in here. Which is a little difficult. Sometimes you can use like a screwdriver... Four, there we go, CC06, and we know our radio is at 120 right now, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to scroll, <clears throat> I'm going to use the message button to scroll down, so the uh, CC, the code goes to 121 uh, maximum, so if we go down to 10, well, that's 21 with the busy light, busy light indicates the 100, so we're at 121 there. So we need to go down one more to make it 120. So we should be good there. We go flip that third switch back down, dip switch back down, FF08. CC 20 with the busy light means 120. UU08. And then we can go ahead from here, use the play button. We're going to long press the play button until dashes come up on the digital readout. This is going to send a test page to our Motorola radio. So we'll try that right now. Ready? So long press, one, two. There's the dashes, let it go. So you'll hear that message and you know that your transmitter is operating correctly.